after you've done everything, yeah, you've uh, bought your feeds, you've given them water, the bills you've paid, uh, in about a month, you can't lack your, let's say 20 to 30, yeah, with the 120 you have here. Yeah, so that is something to look, uh, look up for. Naitwa Bob, uh, nimefanya IT, more than IT, nimefanya farming, farming ya kuku. After form 4, uh, my dad aliniambia maisha yuwanza hapo. So hata kabla niende kampo, nikapewa kuku kiasi za, kunik, za keep up, yeah, story za kunyolewa, story za kredo, story za simu, story za nguo, so ilianza hapo. So haka ni support, haka ni kuku na haka ni pe feeds. Haka ni ambiwasa hapo ndiyo, maisha hako inaanza. So kuweka kuweka, kuweka kuweka, kanza na kienyeji, kaenda enda hivyo, kanza tukaenda layers, keka layers kidogo, 20, 20. After 20, nimeenda ni kigro. So kutoka system ya kuzieka chini, so imefika mbaka, hiyo system umeona hapo. So ilianza kitambo kutoka... Eh, ni maliza form 4 as John Obayati Fashion yiko juu unajua sisi wewe unatafuta do eh, na kama unaona do yako ikitoka mahali si ya struggle sana na unaweza fanya kitu na do itoke poa eh, si kuenda kuiba ama ni pate yani ni struggle na uh, unajua unaweza na si kazi ngumu wewe eh, mwenyewe umejionea hapo ndani nimeingia ni pefe food zinakunywa maji Nia kuambia niko job, nenanga job kuzangu na baki zikikula huku. Na badai bado wata job ikiwa huku bado kwa kuku napata ndo. When I was starting nilianza na kuku zikiwa chini. Lakini sasa hii story ya unenda job, unapata kuna mayai and all. Una improvise na technology. Na umeona cage ni kazi raisi. Very simple. You just feed. Zinajipe maji. We kazi yako ni kukota mai jioni. So if you're working in the morning you go feed them, go to work, evening, ukitoka, you come and uh, get your eggs, yeah. So the cage, kama yo cage umeona hapo, it's about, uh, it cost about 90 to 100k, ye wakati, but that was kitambo. So I'm sure that's why it can be more than seven, less than 70,000. So, na let me not say 70 and you think ni pesa mingi. At the end of the day, in a, in a save time, yako. Yeah. production is 100%, no loss. Yeah. So you have to invest in your part of it. So you see, the amount of money at the end of the day, you can get it. So you can get it. So you can get it. So you can get it. Because I can see the production and the produce I'm getting is 100%. Compared to when I was in the chini, I have to look for the eggs. Sa zingine zimekula mayai, sa zingine zimekanyaga, sa zingine kuna mashida mingi, zimekufa. Eh? But now with this cage, as much as you, I'm saying about 70 and 90,000, uh, diagnosing like uh, when the chicken are sick, ni raisi sana. Yeah? When uh, there is something, yani funny funny things, yani kila kitu unaona, unezaona. Compared to hizi zingine utapata tano zilikufa. Yeah. Hii ilipati ingine uigonjwa, zika kufa, zilelekea kumi. Before you know, nyumbi imeenda kuisha. But now this one, it is, uh, it is easy to scout. Well, once umeona moja, unaipeleka kando. Hii tafekti hizi zingine. Wana. Production ya mai iko hapo. Yeah. Kama, ni, ha, kama zinataga 20, the 20 of them utazipata hapo. Yeah. Kama ni maji, it is automatic. So there is no much time you will spend inside there. You just go feed. Wait in the evening. If you are to add, unongeza jioni. Yeah. So it is very reliable and very easy. Yeah. So for people who are multitasking, like you have two jobs, easy system ya tita kufunga. Yeah. You see, at lazima you have to be there 24-7 watching, knowing what you're doing. Apana, apana. It is very easy. Mwona. I've fed them. Within 20 minutes, I'm done. Kuwakota maa inda ikambili. You see, ya tita chukua siku mzima. Pick and go, pick and go. For the feeds, uh, it is not uh, tasking. For a week, I use uh, approximately <laughs> three bags. So, three bags, uh, si pesa mingi. Kampuni ni mingi. 
za production na food production za layers yeah uh, once you go big scale you can start producing your own feeds yeah but once you are small scale like uh, what i'm doing here you producing your food ni expensive sana because you have to source for materials na uje see materials zote zinatupika the same kuna wengine wanatumia 5 kg zingine 1 kg nyingine a gram so once sasa umeanza kutembea tembea kila mahali ukitafuta it is expensive so what do you do you go for feeds in the animal feeds yeah. haya in the animal feeds kuna kampuni mingi they almost over 150 yeah so you then have not to look for the best feeds hata kama ni expensive you just have to look for the best feed you want to get quality you have to use quality yeah so as much as it's expensive no unapata 100 uh, 100% produce why not go the extra mile i can say you can use between 6 to 8000 yeah for what i have here yeah and uh, it will come back and you'll have something else in your pocket at the end of the day remember we are using money so that you can get more money so that you can get profits yeah so if i can buy and get more money my kukuzangu zimekula and i have something else remaining why not go the extra mile yeah so every time you feed them uh, nikinua chakula there's something that is remaining per week yeah so i've said three weeks uh, three bags per week so per month 12 bags yeah and you don't have to buy all of them pamoja once you sell them uh, this week unanua chakula yako zinakula because ukinunua bulk na zitakuliwa at the end of the bado chakula bado ina arbi yeah so it is easy you you sell your eggs you get your feeds you sell your eggs you get your feeds everywhere we go there must be challenges one uh, for us youth is capital yeah then you don't have to you dream big but you start small yeah so unataka kuweka a thousand chicken lakini you just don't wake up leo na uneka kukudhao yeah so nimeambia mimi nilianza na kienyeji i've gone to layers so nilacha kienyeji bado kienyeji ziko lakini si much layers is what i'm doing and i started with 20 now i am up to 120 and i'm still going yeah so one is capital na capital so you have to start kidogo ukienda as you grow the profit you're making see yote tunakula unaiweka una, una kando for ada siku siku mbaya siku mbaya ni ile time umepata technology kama hiyo ya cage ile unakusanya hiyo do yote unaenda unaiyekelea hapo cage inakuja and you get now double yeah juu time imeisha time imepungua cost ya kama ulikuwa umeandika msee job imeishaisha and you're good to go two ni diseases Uh, diseases nilikuwa na challenge now when they were on the floor on the ground yeah because uh, zikigonjeka ku spread ni haraka yeah but now with the cage uh, once you once you scout and spot uh, once you can sick easy to scout yeah so ugonjo ikaisha two ni feeds 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 zinaleta shida sana before you get the quality feeds the best feeds to make your chicken lay the maximum eggs they're supposed to lay ni challenge but in pole pole uh, depending on where you are uh, you will know what what feed will go for you market yeah market inaenda juu market inaenda chini but at the end of the day hakuna siku utailala nja ukiwa na mayai hata zikienda as low as 240 you're still making profit yeah so depending on uh, where the market is you'll never lack advice to us youth tukubali kuchafuka yeah physically kwenda kuguza hiyo mayai kuguza hiyo chakula kuguza hiyo mbolea yeah because hakuna uh, kitu poa yuto kama ali pazuri you have to sweat for it you have to work for it and work nimesema niko job but at the end of the day bado i have to come back and see kuku zinaendeleaje because i know there is something yeah nimeongea story ya capital so nikisoma story ya capital it means You may think ni capital intensive meaning lazima uko na do mingi ndio uanzishe kitu yeah nimesema you start from somewhere as you go up ile kidogo unapata niko job balado yote nitumie kwa raha ama vitu waziko nguo viatu nini kidogo ya nguo kidogo saving kidogo ya nguo kidogo saving with the kidogo saving you have at the end of the day kidogo kidogo ujaza kibaba yeah so the kidogo you have nunua kukutano weka hapo unaona kuku zangu tano zinakula kitu hapa kaka ongeza kuku zingine 
at the end of the day uko na kukumia kukumia zinakupatia do nunua cage kama hiyo ume relax ni story inaisha so at the end of the day hata corona ikikam itupate si hata tusema hadi juni mezoya kwenda job hadi sasa sina kitu ya kukula uko na kuku zako hapa kaa nazo juona nazo hata zipe majina eh hapo ndio do yako inatoka yeah. so at the end of the day we are looking for money na there's no particular place money should come from from the farm from the office from anywhere as long as you get the money at the end of the day is we get we get what you're looking for yeah we are a living so if you can get money through side hustle kama ya kuku sai fine if you can get it through the office fine but remember a time like this there's a pandemic yeah a lot of people are at home yeah and you're one of them and you have to eat you have to feed you have to pay your rent Ya, yeah. no kona kaspes kadogo hapo kwako. Why don't you jenga ka small ka hat, eka kukutano, you go expanding is fika 15, zifika 20 na unaziona ziko hapo. Ya. Yeah. Kiji kama hiyo itaki space kubwa, itaki eka moja, itaki kuota. Tunaongea story ya square feet. Ya. Yeah. Na hakuna kitu na lose. Weka kuku zako hapo, eh, pia food pata do yako ya kando. Yeah. Pandemic ikuja kama saa hii tusianze tena kusema tusaidiwe. Let the government help us hapana. You help yourself kwanza kama mwingine anatusaidia. So once you have now your kuku kuku zako ziko hapo zinakupea do kidogo, una survive tu. 